an impromptu air show over Haney this afternoon. Four aircraft from the Canadian Museum of Flight put on the demonstration, partly as a rehearsal for Saturday, partly for our benefit, but mostly for the sheer joy these volunteers get out of flying their lovingly restored aircraft. This is the machine that will do the majority of the flying on the BC leg of the Cross Canada journey to commemorate Canada's aviation centennial. She is a 1937 Waco cabin, an aircraft with a rich history. Originally purchased by the federal government, the Department of Transport retired the Waco in the early 50s. It was uh, bought by a, a fellow by the name of Dr. Jack Pickup. And uh, he then, uh, a doctor at the time, uh, and uh, became our, our BC flying doctor, if you will, and, and flew the aircraft up and down the coast. In 1980, Dr. Pickup donated the aircraft to the Canadian Museum of Flight, and an 18-year restoration project began. The finished product is at least as good as the day the machine rolled off the Waco assembly line in 1937. This would very definitely be a, a big find. There's not many of these airplanes around and uh, certainly not many in the condition that this aircraft is in today. So, uh, so that, that would be a big plus for, for the museum. Today, the cabin is being piloted by Dave Beals and Vic Bentley, who combined have nearly 100 years of flying experience between them. They are also the two men charged with the responsibility of flying this priceless aircraft over the Rockies one week from today. The rest of our aircraft will escort her out to Hope and they'll turn back from there, and our pilot and co-pilot will be on the way to uh, Nanton, Alberta. But prior to that, the Canadian Museum of Flight will host a party on Saturday with all sorts of activities planned. And of course, you're invited to participate, meet the volunteers who make the museum go, and see their lovingly restored aircraft on this, the 100th year of flight in Canada. David Kincaid, CTV News, Langley.